So this is about theory. The theory subproject is led by Alain Destex, who is at the CNS in France, and I'm supporting him a little bit, and I'm at the EPFL. The theory project follows the simulation by supporting it with mathematical tools, and one of the big aims of theory is to link different levels of description, going from microscopic to macroscopic using systematic mathematical tools, and theory will also be involved in learning and plasticity where we need a, a rigorous mathematical framework to describe plasticity. So within the consortium the theory project is necessary because it's the group of people which will make the link from the very detailed biophysical models to the more abstract models. The theory is also important to guide the development of learning and plasticity rules while for neuron modeling, there's a reference model, the Hodgkin-Huxley model. For learning rules, for plasticity, there's no such reference model. And so we need a solid theoretical framework to put plasticity experiments and learning at the behavioral level together. There are two aspects which are probably important for the larger community of theoreticians, which is uh, out there. Uh, the first one is that one of the aims of the subproject is to have a theory institute in Paris where theoreticians from all over the world would meet and uh, theory always is, is at its best when it's developing ideas that come out of discussions uh, in, in a very open environment. 